Hey y'all and welcome back to my channel. Today I will be doing a plan with me in my Louis Vuitton large ring agenda. I don't know if this is considered a plan with me or a setup video, but I just want to show y'all how I set up for the week and put in my plans. So I have had a sore throat for the past 24 hours, so I'm like sipping on green tea with honey and I probably won't be as loud, but I'll try to raise the volume up as much as I can. I just really wanted to record this video for you guys and start doing these weekly during Vlogtober um, so that way y'all can see how I set up each week and when it differs based on plans. So we are going to power through. So let's jump in to the schedule section. So first thing I do every week is check out the monthly calendar. And so luckily in October we don't have any plans. Uh, my fiance is going to go back home to Virginia to see his family. I can't go because of school, mirror surgery, recovery, and finances. Um, I'm glad October is a little less stressful because September was very busy. So I'm glad that we don't really have any plans. We just have my sister and my dad's birthday at the end of the month. Also at the end of the month, my current class that I'm in ends and the new class will begin. So in my doctoral program, we take one class at a time and it's two classes per semester. So we don't have anything at all this week. So that's good. Um, so we're just going to jump into the weekly overview. It looks like I need to move the bookmark. Here is this current week. The only thing I have going on this week is a meeting for a class meeting for school. So I'll need to put that in my new hourly section that I'm about to show y'all. But for the most part, unless something big pops up like a reservation or a dinner or um, I don't know if we decide to do something or, you know, like go to the movies, I would add that in. But since I don't, nothing has popped up um, right now, that just stays blank. We just moved over the bookmark and we'll call that section good. I have been using these Elmon paper coat inserts to break down my weeks and I'm going to continue to use it next week just because I've really loved it. I use these stickers from Papery Planning to add the dates and I just love the overall look. And we're going to do the same thing for this week. So let's set this up. So I've just been categorizing this week by week. I haven't, um, I don't think you had the same categories every single week. So last week it was like schedule, work, school, blog. And this week it was schedule, work, school, to-do list. Schedule, work, projects, but this was school. And then again, to-do list. Um, and that's when I added it. I've used this last section before to like track orders when there's a lot of orders and so on. Um, but for the most part, I added these back in so I can really break down work, school, and content planning, especially since I'm doing Vlogtober. So we're gonna do the exact same thing. So I'm gonna grab my papery planning date dots. So really exciting news. I am a part of the papery planning PR team for um, October until the end of the year. So I do have a discount code of papery planning. I am really excited to be a part of this team because it's a lot of content creators that I really love and some new ones that I just got introduced to being a part of the team. So um, I'm looking forward to doing this. And um, as you all know, I've been obsessed with papery planning lately. So I love the ability to give you all a discount code. So it is Linda Tam with papery planning. Um, if you've been watching my planner haul videos, Genevieve, who's the owner, actually sent me a, um, like, PR kit, um, like, a few months ago, and I've been obsessed with that kit, or her stickers, ever since, and so when I saw that she was taking the applications for the Q4 PR team, I knew I just had to apply, and so I'm so happy to be a part of the team. She is amazing, and as y'all know, I'm obsessed with her stickers and absolutely love her stickers and they're just so functional. Um, but we have that in. Now to add the plans, I also need to check my work. 
Google Calendar to make sure that I add in anything important going on on work. I don't put all of my work tasks on here, just like my meetings and things that are relevant to my personal life. Um, I'm gonna use these stickers from Infinite Lotus. So on Thursday, we have a meeting for class. Now I'm gonna add in some deadlines for school. So I am gonna be using the paper planning stickers just because I have the minis. So we're gonna do the stone gray mini dots. Um, but what was I talking about before I got distracted? Oh, being a part of the BR team, very excited. Also looking forward, I customized a freebie and I am really excited for y'all to see it. So let me actually pull it up. So I was working with her once I was accepted on something and so I wanted to make it really like fun and like something that y'all know it was me. And so I've been obsessed with the large black um, drops and then I added the minis and then regular stone dots because those are, as y'all know, what I've been using primarily in my planner. And then I'm ordering custom scripts, but I wanted to put them on the freebie to have work, deadline, and meeting. So I am obsessed and in love with my freebie. So whenever you use my code, you get 10% off and that freebie. So I'm really excited for that and just how the sheet looks because I feel like this is definitely me. Um, but yeah, I have that, wanted to share that. What was I, what else was I doing? Um, I'm gonna go through and add in all of my deadlines for school as well as any meetings for work and then we will go on to the next section. Okay, so I added in everything that I have right now. A lot of stuff will come up during the week, but that is the current week and the current setup. So we're good there. And then we just need to move over my school section. So not much is needed in the school section. Um, this is primarily where I just check off to make sure everything's done. I also break down things if I need, um, like further planning. So if I wanna like break down a paper that I'm working on to do that. And I have one due this weekend, so I'll probably do that in here. And I'll break down the sections that I wanna work on. Um, for the most part, this just holds all of the deadlines. I need to finish up all of this after this video. So once that's done, I'll check it off. But I like having this just because it's, you know, everything um, broken down, so. Um, that is good now that we moved over the tab and there's nothing to add and then the last section is these new inserts that I've been using from Infinite Lotus so Maddie Plans shared a video I think a week or so ago and I saw these inserts in that video and I have never seen these inserts before I wish I would have known that Infinite Lotus has hourly inserts y'all have heard me say so many times before that I need hourly inserts that you know are like all day these go from six o'clock in the morning to midnight and when I, when i saw them i like did a double take because i was like are those from infinite lotus because they look like they're from, from infinite lotus and i went on the website and like looked for them and found these and they're a printable version which may, maybe why i didn't find them um i don't know but i have been using these ever since and i am so happy that she shared these because this is like the perfect view so i moved this to my professional section so this is where i'm keeping my work anything for work and then anything for content planning and blogging and then i put the hourly section because this helps me break down what i'm doing and when when i'm filming when i'm editing what's going on at work so it's ultimately just a normal 
like hourly section but I do go into pretty like lengthy details on like work stuff and um, content stuff but y'all I love these so I've been putting the videos that go up each day in the little note section up top mapping out my day the weekends don't have hourly times but it's fine I just have my list of things that I need to film because that's when I do a lot of my content planning and then down here there are priorities there's a memo box and then um, two columns of to-do lists so this is primarily where all the content lists go and again just absolutely in love and obsessed with these and wish I knew that these were an option before um, because I love them so We'll be setting this up. That is um, that and then other than that my planner is officially set up for the week so I still like to keep this view open on my desk and sometimes I have it on this like if it's probably like on Monday and Thursday when there's a lot going on I'll probably have my um, agenda open to this page but for the most part I have it on this view because I have my checklists of things I need to do and it has everything categorized so other than that that is going to be it for this video if y'all have any questions please feel free to let me know and thank you guys so much for watching